Discord can be a tricky place, and that's why in this video I'm going over three things, whether you're joining my Discord or looking to create your own, that will help you have the best Discord experience. First and foremost, it is no secret that rules suck. And in this Discord, you're not gonna see a hashtag rules channel. Instead, you're gonna see the word culture. Rules are a bunch of negative things to avoid, but culture is a bunch of positive things to build. And really, what is culture? Culture is another way of just saying, hey, what's it like around here? What's the vibe around here? And culture is something that you and I get to be a part of building together. So I wanna encourage you, head over to the hashtag culture channel, check out what we wanna build around here, and then click that thumbs up to say, hey, I agree to help being a part of helping build this culture. Now, when you do that, you're going to see all the rooms just magically appear. All the MMO rooms, all the different rooms that we have to offer for games. And I want to encourage you to utilize those rooms. Head into the voice channels, head into the text channels, check out the info channels to see a little format that you can copy and paste into the intro rooms and introduce yourself. Meet some other people that play the same game and go get connected with them. But also, in some of the rooms you're going to see, I'm actually pointing people to some other discords and here's the thing my main goal is not just to build my own discord build my own brand or name my main goal is to give all of you the best discord experience ever so if there's some other communities like for example a world of warcraft discord with a guild that i play in if i know that they've already got the infrastructure to give you the best discord experience ever then rather than trying to reinvent the wheel over and over again Sometimes I even just go hang out in there and I might invite y'all to just come over there with me. They're already doing it right, so let's go over there, let's hang out. And then when there's moments when we wanna maybe play some other games or maybe just kinda be with our own community, then we'll come back here and chill. But let's not keep reinventing the wheel. Let's go over there and also be supporting other discords all while creating a community that we all get to enjoy. Second thing, temp rooms. Now this is a godsend, friends. Maybe you've been in a Discord room where you've been in a voice channel with maybe four or five of your friends. You're playing in some Valorant or maybe doing a dungeon in World of Warcraft and it's a time mythic dungeon. Regardless, you're sweating it out. You're really focused on the gameplay. And then some random guy joins, not playing, and starts telling you, bro, I just bought a dress for my chihuahua. And you're like, bro, not the time or place. And you don't want to be the rude guy to ask that guy to leave or tell him, but he's kind of talking over while you and your friends are giving comms and it can be a difficult experience for everyone. Some of y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. And the solution to avoid this is most people just create their own private DMs and no one really even sometimes uses Discord voice channels. But then what happens to Discord servers is they look dead. They look like no one uses them, but the reality is those people are playing together just off separately and temporary channels is the solution to all of that. No matter what activity you're doing, if you scroll down to the hashtag temporary channels, you can make your own temporary channel that you can then drop down into the other temp channel interface and you'll be able to see everything that you need. How to make that room visible or invisible. How to make that room locked or unlocked. You can even click one button and add your own temporary chat that you and your friends can join. And then as soon as you leave, that room automatically deletes. If you're the room owner of that and you leave before your friends do, the room automatically gets transferred to one of your friends. It's absolutely fantastic. And so I would encourage you, instead of using your own DMs, join the temporary voice channel. You can lock it if you need to or leave it open and let it be a community where people can see. If they just join, they can see, wow, look at all these people in a voice channel. This Discord is alive, it's popping, there's great culture and community here, but I can't just join if they're in the middle of a great game. So whether you're making your own Discord or you're trying to figure out how it works around here, I promise you, no matter what your gaming needs are, the temporary channel is gonna be the need that you need to learn how to use because it's gonna work in your favor. And last but not least, if you are a Patreon supporter, go to your Patreon account. At the top right, scroll over to your profile picture, scroll down to my profile settings, then you're gonna see a new tab pop up, click on connected apps and just click connect to the Discord. Very, very simple. What this is gonna do is this is gonna allow you to get some of the Discord perks from being a Patreon subscriber. You're gonna get some of those emotes. You're gonna get special access to the rooms that you subscribe at, whether it's the tier two King Penguin or Queen Penguin or the tier three Emperor Penguin. All Twitch subs and Patreon subs get special access to the Royal Penguin room, but the other ones will get exclusive access to those specific rooms, and that's just gonna happen automatically for you. There is a little bit of manual work on my end, but don't worry about it, I'm gonna take care of that for you people, okay? But if you're a Patreon subscriber, make sure you do that so that you get all the exclusive access that you deserve to get. And if you're creating your own Discord, just know that this option is there. You can give your Patreon subscribers 
all kinds of support and all kinds of benefits in your Discord as long as they are able to connect it. And this is gonna give them an incredible experience. So friends, whether you're watching this on YouTube, drop the description and join the Discord. And if you're watching this in the Discord right now, go ahead and subscribe to this channel. But all of you, no matter where you're watching, hey, be sure to come hang out with me live on my Twitch channel. Link in the description below, twitch.tv slash Tuesday Live. But friends, I can't wait to provide a place for you, for all of us to be able to come and enjoy culture and community. Man, life's got so much struggles and drama in it. And I want this place to be an escape for all of us together. Let's head in the Discord. Let's hang out together. I'll be in there from time to time. Be sure to hit me up. Can't wait to get some games with you. We'll see you guys soon.